Health, Fargo Cass Public Health Director Desi Fleming received the 2022 Friend of Medicine Award from North Dakota Medical Association. This award is given each year to a non-physician who has distinguished themselves by serving as an effective advocate for health care, patient services, or profession of medicine. Desi was given the award in recognition of her outstanding and selfless public health leadership during the COVID-19 pandemic. Thank you, Desi. Library. North Dakota Job Service will offer on-site walk-in services at the main library on October 18th from 2 to 4. The session is free and re registration is not required. Services available include job seeking assistance, veteran services, information and training programs, resume building assistance, limited unemployment insurance assistance, and migrant and seasonal farm work services. Teens are also invited to create creepy crafts on October 20th at 2 p.m. at the main library. All materials will be provided. And the weekly Crafter Noon events for kids continues through December 13th on Mondays at Carlson Library and Tuesdays at Northport Library. Sessions are from 3 to 4.30 p.m. Water. During the annual North Dakota Water and Pollution Control Conference held recently in Bismarck, the City of Fargo's water was voted as the best tasting tap water in North Dakota. Fargo earned the title through blind test taste, and Fargo has been invited to compete in the American Water Works Association National Tasting Contest of June of 2023. So that's a great honor our team got, and they've worked hard on it. The Red River is hard to clean up. There are two videos tonight on the ComGA team. The first is the highlights of the expansion project at the water, Fargo Water Reclamation Treatment Facility, which is nearing completion. When completed, the project will double the treatment capacity to 29 million gallons per day, and the expansion will expect to be operational in early 2023. This will truly help many people in the community, and what West Fargo is especially excited about, they get rid of their lagoons, right? Yeah. Also, the uh, second video is about the City of Fargo Native American Commission and Indigenous Association, who co-hosted a kickoff event for Indigenous People Day. The festivities include this Gladys Ray Indigenous People's Day Award presented to Darlene Tenbear for her dedication and service to the Native American community. Thank you. Mm -hmm.